His fuse is pretty short. Dragon's Walker ploy exposes Rabito's massive problem. Rookie halfback Lachlan Ilias may have been hooked during the Rabbitohs' 32-12 loss to the Dragons on Thursday, but the spotlight has now turned onto halves partner Cody Walker. In particular, the 5 temperament has come into question, with Andrew Voss labelling it as a massive problem for South Sydney. Last year's grand finalists looked far from premiership contenders in Wollongong as the Dragons ran in six first-half tries to leave Rabbitohs coach Jason Dimitriou scrambling for answers in a bid to add more energy and experience to his spine. Dimitriou took Ilias off and moved Cody Nikorima into the halves, with Blake Taft filling the void at fullback. Aaron Woods though revealed on Saturday that the Dragons intentionally tried to get under Walker's skin as part of their game plan, and it worked while Woods said the main goal was to first win the battle up front, he made it clear that targeting Walker was also a way to get on top. With a player like Cody Walker, you know he's got that extra responsibility. Woods said on Triple M, with Latrell Mitchell not being there, he's the dominant player in their spine. So, if we can get him off his game a little bit, try frustrate him and pressure him we know he does get a little bit angry. The fuse is pretty short with him and you can get him off the game. That was part of it, the game plan. They are also a side where, I know we had a good lead, but if they put a couple of sets together they can score 20 points in the space of 15 minutes. The Rabbitohs did end up putting 12 points on the board in quick fashion, threatening to make a comeback before errors crept into their game again. South Sydney left itself with little room to move after a horror first half, with Fox League's Greg Alexander calling it disastrous in commentary on Thursday night. They were frustrated and it was disastrous for Souths, Alexander said. They made errors and they are losing their heads out there. It is up to their senior players. You can't have senior players out there losing their heads and getting frustrated at what is going on and pushing and shoving and not concentrating on what they need to. They need to fix their defence and there has to be more energy from them. Speaking about Walker on Sen 1170 the following morning, Alexander said the South Sydney 5 8 was completely distracted. Cody Walker can be a frustrated footballer sometimes, he said. But last night was as bad as he's been in terms of being distracted. He didn't have the game on his mind at all, he wanted to pull, push, shove players, he was completely distracted. Cody needs to focus on the game and keep his cool. It got to the ridiculous stage last night that anytime he was near a Dragons player he was pushing, pulling, shoving. You can't have a senior player carrying on like that. While Walker's temperament may have come into question after Thursday's game, Dimitriou had confidence that would not be an issue for Ilias, declaring the rookie will bounce back. It's part of the learning, Dimitriou said. He's not the first bloke to have a bad day at the office. He wasn't on his own. He's resilient, he has good temperament. He will learn from that.